Welcome. Today I'd like to present a solution which uh, enable quite quick and uh, easy attaching of different functions to to virtual variable content keyboard. Let me present it in this way. This is an analog solution to commercially available Elgato Stream Deck. What it is in fact is just a touch screen, uh, seven inches in size, uh, 1024 to 600 pixels. It is delivered as a set together with acrylic frame and two cables, HDMI and USB cables, just for the purpose of human machine interface for Raspberry Pi. But as it is shown here, it can be used also for some other purposes. HDMI cable is used just to transfer video, USB for transfer of um, touch screen. I applied some changes to it. Uh, I have put th those parts in a different place of the screen just to make it more convenient for my for my uh, for my application. What I present here on the screen is uh, so-called Otagle um, application, which is anagram of Elgato. It uh, mimics numeric keyboard of regular full size or 100% size keyboard. So one can get, get access to all the functions in three different ways. One way is just by pressing of keys on the numeric keyboard. The second way is clicking by mouse on the icons presented here. And the third, and I think the most interesting way of use is just pushing with a finger on the icons presented on, on, on the screen. Uh, I noticed that some people do not like to keep in mind the different shortcuts uh, so to facilitate working with uh, shortcuts the concept presents the icons on the, on the screen to which enable maybe easier way to memorize uh, shortcuts and by by just clicking the icons okay uh, Let's go. On the main screen, uh, I present uh, in the top left corner numlock switch. So in in, uh, in one position, it enables uh, just uh, digits available on numeric keyboard. In the second one, uh, additional functions related to uh, Otagle application. Uh, this is just a, a, a demo, so I present just a few icons on the main screen. Uh, the keypass icon, which runs uh, this application or switches to a already opened window. The same with uh, Word, Microsoft Word, Microsoft Word Office application, and the Total Commander Twin Panel Manager. So after pressing a word icon, uh, focus uh, uh, cursor switches to already opened window with uh, word document. Let me now generate some text. Five paragraphs, five sentences. Okay, so we already have some text, and uh, now I present uh, the concept where all uh, where 
um, styles, building blocks and macros are uh, virtual class um, are, are just a set of functions which are connected together within a template document. So without a template uh, you just don't have access to styles, building blocks and macros. Uh, I prepared uh, a, a demo template so to enable those functions I have to attach it first to the current document and I do it just by pressing one, one button so I get information that this the template is already attached to this file and uh, now I can use some styles which are uh, available within this uh, template for example different sizes of headings, different, different levels of headings right Uh, what I already, what I have also prepared are building blocks. Let me present it here. Just three of them. For example, Mona Lisa. Um, uh, <coughs> building block Mona uh, puts a table, one row, two column table, into current document. The left column is a picture the right column contains some text contains some text uh, what I can also do with this with this text mm, I can apply some macros so very very simple uh, visual basic for application uh, functions for example i mark some text and i know that after pressing this button it changes into red and this macro works as a toggle mm, text border which enables or disables borders of text all right and I have prepared also some functions which are already inbuilt into Microsoft Word. Uh, these functions are marked in beige color. So again, let me mark some text. For example, this sentence. And now, after pressing this button, the text gets struck through. Okay, what is the benefit of all these uh, shortcuts and functions enabled by shortcuts well it uh, reduces time needed uh, to apply um, changes into document for example strike through is of course available conventionally conventionally through the um, menu let me do do it so i choose home font and now you just mark with the function strike through but it's much convenient and quicker just to press one button the same story is about all those functions presented in this in this film for example attachment of template requires a lot of clicking you have to go uh, into this menu now click attach now go over the uh, folder tree I already remember where it is but usually it takes a lot of time to find it Right, and then one should also mark this tick and then press OK. So all these actions are combined into just pressing of this one button. Right. 
So that's it. This is just a demo prepared uh, in uh, and the Otalgo application is prepared in AutoHotKey, very powerful solution. Uh, if you want to know more about this particular application, please read the description below this video. Thank you very much for your attention.